Bridges have been around for centuries, but became much more advanced during Roman times. Exponentially, bridges have become larger, longer, taller, and wider as time has gone on. Today's bridges are longer than the eye can see and are outfitted with groundbreaking technology. On this episode, we'll take a look at the top 10 longest bridges on Earth. Number 10, Hangzhou Bay Bridge, China. The Hangzhou Bay Bridge opened on May 1st, 2008, making it the longest sea crossing bridge in the world. It spans 22 miles or 35 kilometers in length, which took four years to complete. The bridge connects Ningbo's Ziji to Zaijing. This highway bridge features a cable-stayed portion in the middle, which was chosen to endure the earthquakes and typhoons that occur in the region. The completion of the Hangzhou Bay Bridge reduced the trip from Ningbo to Shanghai by 112 miles or 180 kilometers and reduced the time travel by two hours. The challenging design of the bridge required over 600 experts and a decade to design. Offshore construction, turbulent waters, and pockets of underground methane are just a few of the construction obstacles faced by engineers during this project. Halfway across the bridge is a man-made island called Land Between the Sea and the Sky, which houses shopping, parking, restaurants, and a hotel. Number 9. Yunkan Bridge, China Opened in August 2008, the Yunkan Bridge completed the beijing Tianjin Intercity Railway. This high-speed rail-only bridge connects the 73-mile or 117-kilometer path between Beijing and Tianjin. The bridge itself measures 22 miles or 35 kilometers in length, just as the previous bridge, but this one is just 650 feet or 200 meters longer. The building of this bridge reduced the time between northern China's two largest cities from 70 to 30 minutes. This is possible because of the sheer speed of the train. The CRH trains travel at a top speed of 217 miles per hour or 350 kilometers per hour. A second phase of this line was completed in 2015, extending the line from Tianjin to the Binhai New Area Subdistrict of Yuejiapu. How would you feel traveling at three times the speed of a highway in a train over water on a bridge that you can't see the end of? Number 8. Manchac Swamp Bridge, USA the Manchac Swamp Bridge carries Interstate 55 almost 23 miles or 36.7 kilometers over Lake Maropass in the southern U.S. state of Louisiana. This four-lane bridge spans one-third of the highway's total distance over water. It cost $7 million per mile to build the bridge. Piles were driven 250 feet or 76 meters into the swamp floor to make sure it was stable. An impressive feat of engineering for sure, this bridge opened in 1979 and features a twin concrete trestle bridge design which took 120,000 feet or 36,000 meters of concrete to complete its construction. Number 7. Lake Pontchartrain Causeway, USA The Lake Pontchartrain Causeway Bridge, also in Louisiana, runs a total distance of 23.8 miles or 38.4 kilometers. This four-lane bridge completed its first round of construction in 1956 being the southbound section, and in 1969 the northbound section was complete. The idea for this bridge has been around since the 19th century. In the 1920s, an idea for a long bridge hopping across multiple islands was proposed. In the 1930s, a ferry service opened up, and by 1948, a concrete plan was devised to build the Lake Pontchartrain Causeway. It was anchored with 9,500 concrete pilings and built at a total cost of around $76 million. Initially, tolls were collected going both directions, but to alleviate traffic congestion on the south shore, the toll was removed from the northbound bridge. Today, the toll is $5 traveling on the southbound bridge or $3 with a toll tag. Number 6. Beijing Grand Bridge, China Completed in 2010, the Beijing Grand Bridge opened in 2011 and spans 29.9 miles or 48 kilometers between Beijing and Longkong. This bridge is a high-speed rail bridge or classified as a railway viaduct bridge that floats over the surface of the ground. The longest span of the bridge measures 354 feet or 108 meters. This high-speed rail train completes the route from Shanghai to Beijing. This route is called the Jinghu High-Speed Railway that takes 4 hours and 48 minutes with only one stop at Nanjing. Not only is this bridge immensely long, but this railway is the longest high-speed rail built in one construction phase. Number 5. Bangna Highway, Thailand The Bangna Highway in Thailand, or officially known as the Burfa Withi Expressway, is a 6-lane mega toll bridge that floats up off the ground. It is considered to be an elevated viaduct with average spans of 138 feet or 42 meters. 
This box girder bridge was completed in January 2000, which required 63 million cubic feet or 1.8 million cubic meters of concrete to build. This bridge has two elevated toll plazas where the lanes widen to 12 lanes. This bridge doesn't cross any body of water on a large scale. It only crosses the Bang Pakong River. Number 4, Wenan Wahi Grand Bridge, China. Yet another bridge in China. Yeah, they really like their large bridges. The Wainan Waihe Grand Bridge is a part of the Zengzhou Zian High Speed Railway. This railway connects Zengzhou and Yan'an in China. This bridge is 49.5 miles or 79.6 kilometers, which crosses the White River twice, as well as the Lufu River, Shidi River, Zi River, Ling River, as well as highways and other railways. When this bridge was completed in 2008, it was the longest one on earth, but since then it's been surpassed by other bridges that we'll get to in a minute. Even though it was completed in 2008, the railway didn't open for another two years after its completion on February 6, 2010. Number 3, Jianjin Grand Bridge, China. Another railway viaduct bridge on this list is the Jianjin Grand Bridge in China, which runs between Longkong and Tianjin, which is also part of the Beijing Shanghai High Speed Railway. This monstrous bridge measures 70.6 miles or 113.6 kilometers. It took four years to build with construction starting in 2006. This bridge is another one completed in 2010 but opened in 2011. The majority of this bridge resides around the town of Hebei in Tianjin. Number 2, Changhua Kaohsiung Rail, Taiwan. The Changhua Kaohsiung Viaduct is the world's second longest bridge which was completed in 2007. It spans 97.8 miles or 157 kilometers from Bagushan in Changhua country to Zhuoying in Kaohsiung. This bridge was built for the high-speed rail that connects Taipei at the north of Taiwan to Kaohsiung at the south part of the island. The train travels at a top speed of 211 miles per hour or 339 kilometers per hour. This high-speed rail has served over 200 million passengers since December of 2012. The view from the train varies quite a bit from electronics factories to beautiful untouched landscapes. The Changhua Kaohsiung Viaduct was built to be earthquake resistant to allow trains to stop safely during a seismic event and to be able to be repaired quickly afterwards. Number 1, Dayan Kushan Grand Bridge, China. The granddaddy of them all, the longest bridge in the world currently is the Danyang Kushan Grand Bridge just outside of Shanghai, China. This route was completed in 2010 and opened in 2011 after a 5-year construction period. It took over 10,000 people at a cost of $8.5 billion to build this 102.4 mile or 168.6 kilometer bridge. This bridge travels across both land and water and roughly parallel to the Yangtze River. There is a 5.5 mile or 9 km section of the bridge that crosses the Yangchen Lake in Shuzhou. During peak times, trains run every 5 to 10 minutes which has reduced congestion and will allow the growing population to move around in a timely fashion. China recognized that this bridge was absolutely necessary and spared no expense building it. Have you crossed any of these super long bridges? Do you want to cross them? Or are you one of those people that are scared of super long bridges? Let us know in the comments below. 